In this problem, we're asked to calculate the rotational density of this f of x, y, z, which is equal to y, z, comma, e to the x, comma, x squared plus y squared, at the point 0, 1, 2, uh, around the unit vector in the direction of the vector 1, 1, 1. So the formula for the rotational density of a vector field at a point around a given unit vector, which we learned, uh, is curl cross f evaluated at the point p dotted with the unit vector u equals rotational density, which I'm calling rd for lack of any given variable name. So uh, what we need to do first is find the unit vector in the direction of 1, 1, 1, because the rotational density needs to have the unit vector uh, which is being asked for here. So uh, the absolute value or the norm of 1, 1, 1 equals root of 1 plus 1 plus 1 equals root 3. So our u is going to be equal to 1 over root 3 times 1, 1, 1. All right, so we have that. Now we can calculate our curl of f, and we do this via the usual uh, pseudo-determinant cofactor expansion method. So we write curl of f equals determinant i, j, no commas, the commas of the matrices, k, and then partial by partial x, partial by partial y, partial by partial z, which are the components of the grad operator, and then our components of f. Uh, so we can evaluate this now. Um, uh, first, we uh, break out the cofactors to uh, assign each of these uh, vectors to its coefficient, so this is going to be equal to i times the um, matrix diagonal from it, or determinant of that matrix, rather. Plus j times uh, minus j, rather, times the determinant of the matrix obtained by deleting the middle column. So this is going to be then plus k times this, uh, this, this minor, so we have our formula for the uh, curl of f, we can continue evaluating this. I'll go back up here. Since we know what the question is. So the first term, here we have uh, partial by partial y, x squared plus y squared, this is going to be equal to 2y minus partial by partial z e to the x, which is 0. So this is going to be equal to i times 2y plus, over here we have uh, minus j, uh, partial by partial x, x squared plus y squared, that's going to be 2x, minus partial by partial z, yz, that's going to be equal to y. So this is going to be minus j two x minus y. Down here we have partial by partial x e to the x minus partial by partial y y z, that's going to be e to the x minus z.
if we evaluate this at our point um, 0, 1, 2, uh, we get grad f evaluated at p equals 2i minus uh, j times negative 1 plus k times negative 1. Uh, so this vector is 2 minus 1 minus 1. Now we want to uh, take the dot product of this with our uh, Sorry, this is 2 plus 1 minus 1. I forgot the 2 minuses. So uh, we have our evaluated curl. And to find the rotational density, we take the dot product of this with our vector, with our unit vector u. So uh, here we have our rotational density. This is equal to 2, 1, minus 1, dot 1 over root 3, 1, 1, 1 which is equal to 1 over root 3, 2 minus 2 plus 1 minus 1. And so we have that our rotational density equals 2 over the square root of 3.